So, Element, let me yeah. ask you this. You know, especially with the rap culture, it's, yeah. re- it's hard not to talk about the decisiveness, you know, of these times that we're going through right now. Yeah. And I think especially with rap, it's brought the black culture together as one. And yeah. um, But then again, I don't know. I mean, I think I have a disagreement with Marissa on this mm. a little bit, but yeah. I feel like we're in an era of stripper rap. Stripper what do you rap. think this is all about? Are we live? Yeah, yeah, we lie. No, I didn't know we we're back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We're I was back. Well, be like, <laughs> no, yeah, you, no. you, you get what I'm uh, saying. Yeah, it's it's um, you know what? I was talking to um, um, I was talking to my brother about it the other day, and basically, it's like it's like dumbed down R and B. It's like, and R and B's not even R and B anymore. Yeah, it's yeah. Like, it really is. I think it's it's actually like you know they say art imitates uh, um life or does life imitate art? And it's like what I think is you know what I think. I think it's spiraling out of control now because I think that like it's to the point where you can actually look at the music and you can see the reflection of society in that music. Like I right. can I can walk in any time period and based on the art or the music that that's that's out currently, I can be like, oh, these people are retarded. Well, and that's why, and honestly, it's one reason <laughs> why I love yeah. I love music because it is supposed to change with our times, culture, influence, and one of the problems yeah. with big radio yeah. is they go, oh, but what made money was two, three years ago, and I only want to play that, and they're not allowing the change to happen, which is why you have the stasis. Well, yeah, and it, uh, yeah. it definitely yeah. seems like, you know, I, I, you know, I'm calling out the women rappers out there. It sounds like a bunch of stripper rappers, like put on a bunch of latex no, clothes you're, you're, and dress up like a porn out, star. You're you're calling out the then, ones that you hear on the radio. Or there at are every some Grammy Awards show. <coughs> I mean, even there, Taylor you know. Swift is trying to look like a stripper rapper. <laughs> well, she's... <laughs> but, <laughs> but then again, you know, I love this track, and I believe this is going to be your new music video, Slick Talk, man. Yeah. I mean, this Everybody is... Everybody likes re- this track. It's I, I really do, too, man, yeah. because, you know, you, you got to have some of that tenacity where you just go yeah. in hot. And so yeah. where did this all come about? Because I know you, you, you smoked out your last uh, your battle rapper that you went up against. So is that where the inspiration came from, or was this a lot of... I'm a rapper. <laughs> I'm a rapper's rapper. I just rap. It's yeah. just whatever's on the top this of your mind. Closet. That's insane. Nobody knows. It sounds so cr- I sonically mastered sound. Like yeah. I can, I can, rec- I can record a whole album on my phone, and nobody would know the difference. That's insane. Yeah, I mean, with technology that's, that today, I mean, people can do that. It's pretty awesome. Well, you're exactly right. I mean, you can just get a computer, you can lay down a beat. I mean, you can easily download mm-hmm. any kind of iPhone or whatever Android app, and you can yeah. literally start creating beats on the phone. Yeah. And it's that's so. Is that back. how Slick Track got started, or yeah. was that on the phone? Yeah. Half the albums recorded in the studio, half's in the closet. I figured out that's how to insane. do it in a way on my headphones. That's wow. Insane. And I mix and I mix and master. So listeners out there, I love no that. excuses. I, mean, I come from a professional background, though. I know how it yeah. should sound. So right. I can, I can, I can get that sound. I can do anything if I see it. If I see it once, I can duplicate it. Your if I want album to. sounds like you threw in like hundreds of thousands of dollars to produce it. Yeah, like it is that. Yeah, it really quality. sounds that well produced. And I really yeah. want to show the listeners out there. Element Rhymes. This is off his latest album, Eleven Eleven. This one's called Slick Talk. Let me show y'all niggas something since y'all think you respect. Uh huh. They really do know. They really do know. Uh huh. Let's do it. Let's do it. Star power to the iron now. Uh-huh. Last rapper that I battled, he retired now. Your career ain't based off talent. A bunch of vegan rappers beefing, trying to make y'all salad. What's the point you trying to prove? You want the ballad or the bullet just to waste your space. I don't think y'all matter. Call NASA, you dripping plasma like alien brain matter. What's the matter? You cross paths with a necromancer. Your ego shatter. Fry your wig like red snapper. Toe tag ya. Swagger back with bad manners. Leather jacket on my back like a black panther bad grandma like bad santa smooth for santana flow susquehanna in the havana like spanish daggers don't chatter much antagonistic like atticus and attica you out of touch don't look down on us we ten towers up flow dirty i ain't shower much you coward sour power tripping off a powder puff i smoke sativa out of sour dutch had a foul mouth before i was allowed to cuss it's much apparent that my parents weren't proud of much was a young and out of dusk trying to bag something robbing thrift stores at 15 isn't that something graduated the gas busting moved on them took a war between the streets and this new conscious few accomplices never rocked with no pompous he a snitch is the consequence i'm a shaman with the cottage flawless about it alchemist of the alphabet these verbal economics autonomic narcotics cause fiends won't stop copping autonomous with the knowledge autodidact never side 
track. Rival anybody who try and rap the top dog. Unidentifiable rhyme pattern. Stay put like an isotope. You bad to the bone and get those shattered. My known fact, throw shade, I'm throwing oak trees back. Suppose you want to brawl, I turn to the hope when mad. This sick flow come with brown paper bags. Your wife and need a nigga cause a man turned to ass. Like everybody dressed in drag. It's sad, but I laugh. Funny style, whipping your ass. Smash glass like Mazel Tov. Straight to the head, Tylenol. Uh, pack a punch like Jim Jones. Now pack a tux. These crackers getting jacked for the shackles they had on us. This track fabulous to grab me. Couldn't pass it up. Mad had it with a cloak and dagger. Nigga, uh, that's enough. Uh huh. I'm gonna let this track breathe. I'm gonna let you breathe. Put the air out your lungs, nigga. Hit hard like that. That was Slick Talk yeah. by Element Rhymes, and we got him right here in the studio. And this is Strike Your Chord, where we play you music if you actually physically pick up that record, or in this case, you know, go to bandcamp.elementrhymes.com, yes, bandcamp. listen, right? Listen, go to Bandcamp, okay? You, you have an option to put in as much money as you want, or no money. Just get the song and tell your friends. Hashtag Element Rhymes. Tell a friend. What are you waiting for? Do it now. Well, support yes. an artist. I and mean, I mean yeah. it's not that hard I, to pay a dollar. Personally, give Come you a hug. Now. Yeah, and ele- <laughs> element. What does uh, the meaning of your album title "Eleven Eleven" mean? Like, yeah. it, it's it's a lot. It means like, um, I mean, there's so many meanings. Uh, mm-hmm. My name is Jeremiah. I was gonna it's, say, it's, a, yeah. it's a biblical reference. I didn't want to give well. away your, you know, because I thought you had to keep <laughs> it to the rapper name. I mean, but, now you're now you're breaking your barrier. <laughs> 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 the veil has been lifted. Yes. <laughs> no more Clark Kent for you. Yes. Well, you know what? It, it's there's so many there's so many reasons why I called it 1111. It's like it's it's like I don't know. I f- there's a skit on the album. Mm-hmm. I actually recite the scripture. And I, I say, we, I yes, call. you do. It's on the yeah, um, God that is mad. was the it was the first one. Your so what's up song? with all that? Because no, no, we, that was your your se- number seven. It was number seven. We yes. tried to pull a clip for it, but oh. we were unsure. We were just we were crunched time. on time, and I really wanted oh. to make sure dude, we'd play all your music. Okay, you got to say what was the <laughs> line where you say like, "Do you want to follow God if He's always mad at you?" Like there was a line in it. Oh, so don't piss him off. Yeah, it was so. Because he's like, he's got a temper. <laughs> I was like, oh, because he's. I said, um, I was just like. Just talking. I, pr- I I produced that track. I didn't pr- I didn't put any production production on there uh, or the skits that I did. Yeah. Uh, but basically, um, I was talking about how he, mo- I think uh, somebody seen the back of, of God's heel and their bro- their body burn, mm-hmm. and I was wondering if he can like who wrote this stuff down. Like, can can you take God's voice if you can't even look at his heel? Yeah. And like so, like mm. I was like, man, God's a pretty mad guy. <laughs> <laughs> he is in <laughs> the Old he's, Testament. He's, he's, he's pretty. He's pretty <laughs> angry. Don't well, get on the bad side because you might not like heels are burning people and yeah. voices well, that's will true. make your head explode. But let me let me kind of switch gears with this because I know there was another single track that you did that was oh, called yeah. Defending R. Kelly. And oh, yeah. I've never, like, I've never <laughs> heard one person that track say too. Defending R. Kelly. And so, but I I I think I understand what you're trying to go at because yeah. you know, yeah, there there's a lot of white heads out there yeah. that are constantly doing the same reparation. And have the same, you know, a- accusations well, up against them, and they don't get the same. It's because there, there's a well, there's a war on people of color. Yeah, I mean, it's yeah. it's within within our laws in there and stuff like that. And I think when I first heard your defending R. Kelly, I was like, "What he talking about?" <laughs> <laughs> no, I literally thought the same thing. I was, I was like, like, "I gotta hear this." I was like, we all know he was peeing on girls. <laughs> I was like, I was like defending R. Kelly, right? You know, and, and it, but was. then then yeah. I listened to your song. Yeah, and listeners. Yeah. Listen yes. to his song because the message behind the song, that is. But how did this all get brilliant. going though? Uh, like, what well, made you just think like I want I need to write a what? song about this the, issue? The, the thing is, like, like I didn't want to write a song about it, but mm. I, everybody just keeps talking about it, mm-hmm. uh, especially at the, especially when it's relevant. Um, so basically, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna write it from my I'm gonna write a song from my perspective and explain because at the end of the day. I'm like, I hear about this stuff all the time. Like, it's yeah. like, yeah. and I mean, black people, we, we make up like 14% of the population. So everybody else is, is, is they're, they're mass and quantity. So it's right. like, it's like, there's more of an opportunity for these things to happen. It, it only makes sense. Since t- it makes sense statistically. So it's like, what we're the only ones that are like broadcasting all the time. Uh-huh. Um, like, well, it's we're not even the only in our ones, politics, like, 24-7, the right? I mean, yeah, it just mm-hmm. needs to be like level. I, don't, I mean, I don't know what it is. It's like, it's wrong. Like. You, you you're messing with like underage like girls and boys and it's like it's all wrong it's like it's like yeah. what's going on but it's who's like, getting actually convicted yeah exactly yeah, yeah. and these I rich guys you know I, I have a theory uh what's his name um 
who that uh, Ep- Jeffrey Epstein? I don't. I, I don't think he. Ca- I think he may have escaped. Huh? You think he escaped and well, got his neck snapped? Where's the body? Or, I think they probably snapped his neck in, in there think, and then got I rid of the body. I don't think, think he escaped. But think about from it. Jail. Think about it. He's a billionaire. Yeah, I know that. He's a, he's <laughs> but if like you're under constant, like if you're in a jail cell, even if you're a billionaire, I don't think right. you can get All out. Right, well, right? Let's, let's uh, on that note. I don't let's know. Play I, I, I defending like R. Kelly because okay, okay. we got our time crunch. We'll come okay. back to our thoughts. <laughs> Here's defending R. Kelly from Element Rhymes. Well, dog just don't want to believe the truth. Well, dog just don't want to believe the truth. Well, dog just don't want to believe the truth. Elvis was a pedophile. Woody Allen too. Oprah protects the pedophiles. I bet you never knew. Is this what he meant? You don't believe the truth? Give me another two minutes, uh, and I'ma give you proof. Oprah, Oprah Weinstein, Harvey liked to party. Pop Molly's like to Molly's. I know he tag team with Bobby. Handy dicks a bitch Ran up in your daughter probably Oh, you don't f with them? But you lock up Bill Cosby What our Kelly did was wrong Don't forget about the Nazis Not to mention the hot seats Let their souls burn Set a blazing their reputation When will they learn? Nick and Michael Jackson's grave Guess a dead man can't rest I know politicians who be touching boys They don't ever get addressed Where's the investigation? Reputation defamation. We don't see them on the news. Guess they want to separate us. Their mothers and fathers told me we're going to destroy your career. But Kelly's emotions remained raw. It's real girls out there missing. Well, dog just don't want to believe the truth. Media lies all the time. The story ain't about all Kelly. White people used to rape us in sex forms. Made boys dress up as girls and dance for them. All I'm saying is don't excuse their actions. Treat them dudes how you do the black ones. Mark that savages, dark and saddening. They will take away all we have been. What about Louis C.K.? Guess that's okay. What about Andy Dick? It's okay where he sticks his dick. About Terry Richardson? And Jerry Epstein. What about Roman Polanski? What does that mean? A Richard Dreyfus, Steven Seagal, Hamilton Fish. What about Jan Wayner? What about Brett Ratner? White people ain't no rats, huh? Guess that's so. What about everybody else? I don't know. What do I know? You convict who you want to convict. It's not about right and wrong, it's about pointing out who's doing the wrong if you think that you know what's right. Niggas want to convict niggas. What about the mother niggas? Those who are white. Everything they do wrong is right, right? <laughs> Funny world we living in. You know what I mean? You paint a picture of somebody and what about that other person? There's so many people on this planet. We pardon who we feel like it and accept who we choose. That's why I don't like anybody. You, 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 and you. Man, fuck all this shit. Get a life, niggas. Well, dog just don't want to believe the truth. You don't want to believe it. At this point, we briefly pause the interview to give Kelly a moment. His publicist helped calm him down. And we're also. Hey, but I wanted to remind all the listeners out there that you're listening to Striker Corner. We got battle rapper Element Rhymes here in the studio. And for our final Striker Corner note, we're going to be actually playing uh, 30, 32 years later. And just oh. could, could you wrap up a little bit about what that, that ending track is all about? Oh, um, <laughs> that's funny. Um, basically, it was, it was my vision of the future. So uh-huh. Basically, I have a lot of visions of the future. So yeah. What, what you see happening in the future? So Can you name something on the top of your head? Oh, like, what you uh, seeing? Oh, I, I think we're going to be able to talk without speaking. I think we're going to be able to use telepathy all the time. Yeah. That would Let's actually be a pretty amazing thing. I, I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, we already got like Stephen Hawkins doing it, right? I mean, we can get anybody doing it, right? I love 
Well, I mean, we only <laughs> use, what, 8% of our brains? <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying. I mean, like, that's already happened. But, I mean, <laughs> that's pretty wild. I can see that. <laughs> yeah, they, they were already talking about flying motorcycles and stuff. Do you see that? <laughs> Do you see myself getting a driver's license on a flying motorcycle? I don't know if that's going to be a, all right. <laughs> <laughs> a flying motorcycle. I mean, you don't see that like, being all right? That would defeat the traffic. Yeah. That could get you. That could get anybody here early at Cal State <laughs> Long Beach. I think but, the song, it, was like, it literally was a vision in my head. Like, I think... People, I used to, I've been saying the same things for a very long time, like what, it, like, and it's slowly happening. That's amazing, like and you it. know what? We're gonna be rehashing that out with you, especially for our off mic segment. But I just want to remind all the listeners out there that we got Element Rhymes here in the studio, and he's gonna be playing. Where are you yeah. playing at? Uh, tomorrow at the Barcada uh, Restaurant and Grill. I'm gonna be freestyling um, over live instruments and performing some of the songs of the new album and um it's gonna be a great it's gonna be a great time you can throw you can come up throw me words i'm gonna rap i'm rapping all night you you gotta just pay attention and and, and look at it it's gonna be beautiful <laughs> <laughs> hip-hop at its finest over a band where can they find you again i know that's amazing over a band element? Oh, instagram element rhymes uh T -O element rhymes tlt on instagram uh you can go on facebook element rhymes uh Bandcamp, element rhymes um, you can go on SoundCloud, Element Rhymes, Element Rhymes, Element Rhymes. Element Rhymes. Element Rhymes. And for the first, Rhymes, it's that and for the first blah, blah, blah. 50 new members of the Chris Collins Show, you get a free CCS t-shirt. Check it out That's at our website, right. chriscollinsshow.com. Go to the store tab, become a member, and get a free CCS t-shirt today. What's good, listeners? I'm the host of the Chris Collins Show. And if you like what you see, hit the subscribe button below. And check us out at thechriscollinsshow.com. Peace.